yes let's make sure you click oh oh yes and then you oh, yes okay let's resume hi guys d sims here and welcome back to the channel and today i bring to you runaway team a hey she got two babies and it's crazy are you ready hey. and we are back with another episode and y'all oh okay i just had to go back and recap the the last episode to like get a groove for this one and it was so much going on like that was so dramatic if you have not checked out the last episode you have to go check it out so Robbie's parents showed up and it was just a big catastrophe you guys were just not for it just like i was um i wanted to introduce her parents though to add a little drama to the series but how it all played out y'all know i let my game play out everything and it was a bit of a mess like it was just not okay it was a weird time it was it was weird timing they were on some weird vibes like it just wasn't what we're about so listen today it's all going to be about getting back uh to the basics and really like focusing on our next big step which is going to be getting sarabi a house um so right now we have a ton of things we need to do um we need to come out here and check the mail i did notice that because it is winter in the desert it's more likely going to rain a lot than it is going to snow um and I just, I like snow for like growing up, like being in the snow was such a huge thing for me. So I definitely feel like uh, when looking for uh, the new house that we want to, girl, go ahead and, and unpack right now. Uh, we definitely want to, okay, she just took her, her first uh, BC pill. Um, we definitely want to have that. I think that's like something super cute for the babies and all that good stuff. So let's just start cleaning because we have so much stuff to do. We need to call the repairman. We have some mopping to do. Like the house is just in shambles. Also, um, we have this little thing here where her internship yesterday was awful. She didn't do anything productive for her internship. Um, so she really, we really need to get back on to that. And we're probably gonna take a couple of extra jobs to try to make up for it because you know, this is a part of our schooling, even though we're not in school. This internship is a grade and we really need to be, we need to be active on it, okay? Um, the babies right now are sleeping. They are hungry, so they're gonna be a little bit grumpy when they wake up, but we're going to uh, try to get everything cleaned up so we can have breakfast for them ready. And I want Sarabi, the kids are gonna stay home today. They're not gonna go to daycare just because I feel like they were out all night yesterday well, in the last part, because of the whole family situation and all that kind of stuff. So I really want Sarabi to work on some work and then we just need to relax. Like, I just feel like after all of that drama, she needs a breather. And that's what we're going to do today. We're going to, y'all know I would take the babies out for a, for a, um, we would take the babies out. Wait, what you mean? Hey, yo, it look like this place doesn't need my service. Yes, it do. Child, hire another repairman. He just gonna keep walking. He not gonna come fix this stuff. I'm so dead. Also, so Robbie is that one person in the neighborhood. It's winter and we still got up our Halloween decorations. Child. <laughs> we need to come on and put this box down and take these decorations down. <laughs> oh my gosh. This had the decorations up for so long. It's about to be Christmas and she still had <laughs> Halloween stuff. Okay, so... Um, I feel like Sarabi needs, girl, what are you doing? Oh, uh -uh, we're not playing in no mud. Oh, that would be so cute for her and the babies to do. <gasps> Maybe we'll play in the mud if it continues to rain. That'd be so cute. Um, so we're gonna wait for the repairman to come. The kids, are they ready to get up? Uh, almost. They're just about ready to get up. Oh, Sarabi do need to get a couple of things done. Oh, is the door unlocked? Is that why he couldn't get in? Oh no, he's in, okay. Um, we need to get Sarabi's stuff up. I need sis to de-stress. Like, I was stressed with just re-watching what was going on. Why does she need to use the bathroom? Oh, no, she just needs some fun. Okay. Um, also, when it comes to... I was actually really shocked about this. When it comes to Auntie Joyce moving into the house, we're not going to do that. You guys were really against it. Y'all was like, Joyce is an adult. Um, she doesn't... Uh, somebody said they were really concerned about her becoming a babysitter. And that's never the case. Like, I feel like Sarabi needs help with the twins all the time because it's just her and she has so much going on. So I don't see anything wrong with her 
uh, I don't see anything wrong with her like asking Auntie Joyce to do stuff because, you know, she just needs that kind of help. And of course, Sokka can help, but Sokka is working right now. And, you know, we just, we go back and forth between the two. I don't want it to seem like we're just using Auntie Joyce. That's never the case. Y'all know Auntie Joyce was riding and dying last night. I mean, why do you saying last night? Like I just recorded this. She was not playing last time, last part. She was like, not for it. Let's go ahead and we're gonna start some laundry. I think we already have some breakfast for them. I wanna give them a hot breakfast though. So maybe we'll, let's look in the cookbook. Okay, let's look in the granny mom cookbook and let's see what we have for breakfast other than cereal. Ooh, some honey banana toast. Ooh, berry Belgian waffles. Ooh, let's do this. Okay, we're gonna make a big portion of waffles. The babies are almost awake. When they do wake up, I do want them to get straight on the potty. So that gives us some time as well. We're gonna have to give out baths. Um, I want Sarabi to take some time to really write in her journal. I feel like that is like something she could do to like ease her mind. And then we're going to go hang out with friends. Um, we're gonna bring the babies with us. There's a, it's like this huge bowling alley skating rink area and they have toddler stuff as well so the family is just going to go out and have some fun um we're also going to do some work as well um depending on when this will all start up okay so oh wait i wanted to add the flower how does she add the flower in does she not add the flower no you used to be oh i think she has to upgrade it yeah she has to upgrade it to the additive tray Okay, girl. Well, in the meantime, we'll wash these clothes. We got the internship stuff today. So whenever my babies are ready, we're going to get them straight on the potty. Oh, they're ready now. Okay. So they're going straight to the potty and then we're going to have food for them. They can come pick it up. I want to turn on, I'll turn on Peppa Pig. And uh, I don't remember the name, Coco Melon. Is it Co Momo Le Lemon? Coco Melon, child. Lulu Lemon. No, Lulu Lemon is the mom store, right? Like, I call it the mom store because all of the, <laughs> all of the families I watch on YouTube, all the moms shop at Lululemon or is it Coco? Uh, I'm not going through this again. <laughs> y'all helped me, but y'all know I forgot. Okay, both of my babies. Oh, Lord Jesus. Y'all right? They so freaking cute. I love them so much. So adorable. Why are they just doing this little rock? What is this rock? Oh, look at my baby. Yeah, yes. Oh, he, oh, oh no. Oh no. Okay, we have two angry babies. They're very hungry. Okay, that's enough. Here, y'all come grab some food, grab a serving. Yes, I know y'all are very hungry. I'm very aware. Oh, they moving. They move a little faster now. Okay, let's go ahead and I wish we could just, I wish there was a function to turn on the TV. Um, ask to turn on the TV, ask your mama. Look, we're not him me mugging his mother like this. Okay, here, Uh, I, I want to turn on the little TV for them. Turn it on. All right, come on and turn the TV on for them. Come on. This is so cute. I love them so much. I love their little routine. Okay, look, there we go. We're going to have that on for them. We're going to come over here and scrap this painting. We're going to get some work done. Oh, wait, she can't get to it. Did I move this by accident? I stay moving this thing. All right, let's scrap the painting. Girl, what's wrong? Scrap. Why can't you get to it? Okay, we're gonna scrap this painting and then we're gonna get some work done. I want her to get some other stuff done as well. Let's move this out the way. Scrap this painting right now. Okay, there we go. Um, we're gonna every time I load into the game, her freelancing job is gone, so it kind of sucks a little bit. I do want to practice this. Um, let me let me pause up. There is the pop art. So no, is it a pop art or abstract? Hold on, let me check. Let me let me see, cause I got the new mod in. I'm ready to check it out. I think I fixed it. Oh wait, hold on. 
uh vice vice has been helping me so much let's see if it gonna work uh yeah so it's abstract let's go for abstract large and i want to make sure i'm giving this vani 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 has been working with me to try to fix the painting overrides and i just want to thank her so much because she's been so patient and helping me so i really hope these work i cleared out everything um uh, what you doing sarabi are you bored um are you bored no i'm not bored but you know i'm just chilling oh it's working i think it works is this one of the paintings i'm not sure at all wait what a, wait where she just put that plate wait where are you going oh absolutely not girl i know you lying to me check out this busted they supposed to be fixing it why are you hello hello she wants to paint a mural girl what wait child hello Girl, if you don't, I didn't put it in her inventory. I just want her to vacuum one thing. And she's cleaning up. Okay. How are we doing over here, Mr. Wyatt? Are you still eating? Oh, look, they're in such great moods. Oh, Auntie Joyce is coming. You coming over? Hey, girl. All right, let's finish this painting. Um, Natalie's wanting to want to go over to her house. No, not right now. We're doing some work and we're going to take us a little job this morning. Okay, let's see what we can do. We could do a movie character concepts, character design for AAA game or triple A game. Oh, world exploration. That's $3,000. Ooh, let's do that one. It's due by Sunday. You need to study the design documents, create an uh, environment concepts on the sketch pad and get environment concepts approved okay great okay so babies are in a great mood i would love to go on a little bike ride with them i love their little family routine they do need baths though definitely need baths okay well maybe just um just a car needs a bath let's ask auntie joy to a bath auntie joy Extra bad from Auntie Joyce. What's wrong, girl? Auntie Joyce, what's going on? Why are you over here groaning? What's wrong? Her eyes bruised. Oh, she came over here to flirt. Oh. Auntie Joyce still mad. What's wrong? Everything okay? You're not pregnant, are you? Okay, no. Just making sure y'all oh look she gonna give her a little she gonna give her god baby a little bath okay what's going on with this with this oh oh i don't think it worked well i was told to do a couple of them and then they should work so maybe we'll keep trying um i do want to study the design documents though use a computer to study the design documents that the client has provided under the freelance category okay we're gonna try that come over here and sit um, we're going to get on the freelancing tab and we're going to study the document. Okay. Auntie Joyce, we need a computer girl. Is my baby clean? Look, she got on her new outfit. Well, she's not clean. Auntie Joyce, please. She's not clean. Ask for flashcards. Oh, they're so cute. Why is still eating his breakfast, watching his show? Okay, let's go ahead and uh, put this in our inventory. This is a really cute painting though. Oh, she gonna study her stuff. Auntie Joyce, what's going on? She don't look good. She got the, she got the little bruise on her eye. She talking about baseball. Um, I need to do something with these paintings over here. So we painted the babies. We have quite a quite a few paintings of them. I think there's another one, isn't there? Oh, wait, no, that's it. Let's put this one in their room. I just don't know where I will put it, child. Oh, maybe we could keep it right there. That's kind of cute. 
All right, let's finish this up because I want to get this work done, my love. Oh yes, reach level five imagination. My babies are so smart. Okay, did you study the document? Yes, now she needs to create three of them. Let's, uh, let's continue doing what we're doing. Um, now that we got all of our stuff, we should have no more slip ups. Do you want to go to prom together? No. We don't want to go to prom freelancer environmental concept. Okay, child, who told you to do this? It's wasted a hundred bucks. Okay, she is inspired, which is really good. Wait, why my baby outside? Well, he going, why he got umbrella up? Oh, it's raining again. I wanted them to go ride their bike. Okay, now him having an umbrella. What? Ciao. Game, hello. Okay, she's still doing her sketch pad. Everybody's up here. Oh, they look so freaking cute. Her little babies and her little old navy feet. She does need a bath. Let's see if she could finish one of these because she has three of them to do and they're due about Sunday. Uh, So we don't have to cram everything in right now. We can actually get ready to go. I think I'm going to go take a little walk. I will be right back. I promise. Oh, it's okay, okay, Joyce. You take your little walk. You need your little hand bone for that eye. She need a frozen steak on this eye. Look, she said, I'm not going to take no walk. I'm going to sleep. You better go take your nap while I'll see Joyce. I'm so dead. Okay, so we did finish one of them, which is good. Um, I wanted to, is this? Oh, it's a surrealism. Scrap that. I want to see if this abstract painting works. I want to see. I'm desperate. Abstract small. Is it working? Wait, who's at the door? Oh, it's Sokka. Hey, Sokka. Um, let's invite him in. I actually was about to call you. I can't tell if this is working or not because a lot of the paintings have this like color scheme. We'll, we'll, we'll keep trying. Hey, Saka, how you doing? He came over. You doing all right? All right, he look, he look like he doing good. So like I'm, I'm ready for us to go take our little, our little family, uh, our little family day. So let's go ahead and get everybody ready since Saka is here. Uh, we're going right over here to the skate rattle and roll this is what i used in my single mother lp i actually went back into the single mother safe file just to get this lot because i love it that much um so we're gonna go here and we're just gonna invite a bunch of friends so my babies will invite joe Saka, uh wyatt lena uh you know our rent our regular schmegular um, maybe Thaddeus is always great to have around. And uh, we'll bring Melody and Natalie. Period. We're gonna, oh, well, I guess just, well, we'll bring Natalie because Natalie's been calling us. So we're gonna go and we're gonna hang out. And again, just de-stress, honey, de-stress. Um, when it comes to the houses, I really want her and Auntie Joyce to like go around and see houses together. We won't move Auntie Joyce into the house. The reason, I don't know if I said this already, I can't remember. The reason I wanted her to move in is because I didn't want to separate them. I really like that they live uh, next door to each other, but we can always give Auntie Joyce a key like we do here already and, uh, you know, go from there. We can give her a key and she can come over whenever she likes. But I just like that they were next door neighbors because that's how it all started. Like, that's just how it all went down. So um, with this lot, there's so much to do. You can come over here and skate. You can uh, bowl and all that cute stuff. I wanted to get her a skating outfit. I thought that would be really cute. Uh, she, he wants to come over here. Look, play make-believe spaceport. And then my baby could come over here and play in the ball pit and all that kind of stuff. It'd be super cute. So the babies have stuff they can do. Are you excited about today? Want to celebrate with me for a little bit? Who is this? Oh, Victor's here. Victor is like really impressed with our work. Like we did really, really well at that art gallery, y'all. Okay, so Sarabi's like, I can go for some food, honey. 
Do we want to come over here and order some food? Do we have something that the babies can eat? We got french fries. Why don't we have like some chip, like some pizza or something? Uh, let's go just order some french fries. Oh, they're all hanging out and stuff. They're so cute. A lot of people are saying they're still, some people are saying they're not for soccer. They feel like it's forced. Child, at the end of the day, I'm gonna say that they fine. Feeling close with someone nearby. Like, we're just gonna let it happen. I believe that they are a thing. So, I'm gonna let it happen. My babies is having fun. Okay, we still got ba babies who need baths and stuff, but I'm gonna let them play. Oh, look at them play together. That's so cute. That must be amazing to have a twin that you always can, you know, do stuff with and you have someone like you. That's so adorable. That's so cute. Look, so Robbie, like, let me see my baby. Okay, let's play spaceport with them, with Wyatt. So freaking cute. Okay, we got a baby who needs to tinkle. Oh, we don't have, oh, they don't have toddler toilet. Oh, I don't think they do. Oh, look at him play with imagination. How cute. Okay, go be with him. Hurry up, Sarabi. Uh, let's ask for, can she ask for help or is she good? Oh, she's coming to watch her mama. This is so cute. Come play spaceport. You want to play spaceport? Come on. Where's the Robbie? Play with him. Look at him play with the little wheel. This will never get old for me, ever. They're so cute. Look at them, but they're so adorable. Y'all wanna play spaceport? Keep going. Play the make believe. It's not working. <laughs> it's not working no more. Okay, she's hungry. Do you wanna come get some? Oh, here, let me put the french fries right here. Come grab a serving. Okay, he's good. Uh, there is no, to like, baby potties. Let's get some baby potties. And then I want Sarabi to go skate. Like when I was thinking about what I wanted to do this episode, I was just like, if I went through what she went through, I would definitely like get on some rollerblades. Like I was thinking of stuff they can do in The Sims. And I was like, I would get some rollerblades and just skate. I wish I could do montages as easily as I'd be thinking about them. Okay, let's go to the potty. And then when we come back, both of you guys can get some food. Yes, get some food. The babies are pretty much taken care of, so I'm gonna have Sarabi uh, enjoy herself a little bit. Okay, let's invite the skate. Wait, what happened to all our friends? Oh, we got a bowling league here. What happened to everybody? Did they leave? Well, let's at least get Sokka back here. They can have a they can have a little family day. I want her and Sokka to skate together. Okay, babies are pooping and they're about to eat some french fries. They're gonna be good and Gucci and all that good stuff. Invite to skate. Let's go. Let's invite to skate. Let's get on our skates, girl. I wish we could personalize our skates. That would have been so cute. Period. Stay around. Period. Wait, what is the skating skill? Is it <clears throat> is it a hitting skill? I can't remember. Oh, it must be girl, cause you're not good at it. Oh, she wants to go ice skating. Well, now nah, we gonna go regular skating. I wish the babies could skate. Come on, so I can skate with her. Let's. Oh, skate, <laughs> roll, bounce. Ooh, y'all gonna break y'all necks. I thought I told her to eat some french fries. She's still hungry. And my babies is 
are eating this a whole bowling league here. Wait, y'all want to skate together? Oh wait, we could customize the rink. Oh, we could turn on some uh let's turn on some, some they got some classics, not classic music, but like some old classic. Let's do some retro. And then skate around. Period. Y'all better skate. Oh, and then what else can we do with the rink? We can set lighting. Turn on party light. And set effects. Ooh, let's do some stars. I know this right. Oh, this music a little loud. Um, change the station. Yeah, let's listen to, to the hip hop station. Period. Saka, so y'all come skate together. Where you go? Who is this? Oh, Tobias. Got the do rag on at the uh at the thing. Oh, it's real blue over here. Okay, babies, how we doing? Oh, we got a sleepy baby. We got a sleepy baby. We got a stinky and a sleepy baby. Oh no, my little babies, my little tanks are tired. It is 10 o'clock. Maybe they can come over here and do a little power nap because I was having a good time. You better skate, Sarabi. I feel so bad about everything that happened with her and her parents. Like, I just feel like that was so, I feel like I added, it was a little toxic. But you know, it happens. It really do. Her parents just coming around. They was that was just that was so bad, y'all. That was so bad. But you know what? I think I want to start looking into neighborhoods to see where we're going to move to because I feel like I don't even feel like we we need a house hunting episode. I feel like we should just get the house built. But I mean, let's be realistic. Sixty two thousand dollars isn't enough to get a house built but i feel like after she continues doing all her paid internship opportunities that she'll have enough what y'all think where did Saka go did he leave maybe Saka stuff is forced he left again yeah a lot of y'all was saying she should just date around or whatever i don't know i can't tell it's like every episode is totally different it's totally different but let me go ahead and take these babies home. They're sleeping and tired and stuff. It was supposed to be a little family day, but Sokka didn't hang around. But I'm happy the babies got some time. The babies had a little bit of fun. So, yeah, maybe we'll, like, scope the neighborhood tomorrow. Maybe we'll send the babies off with Sokka. Maybe he could do that. Um, And then we'll take Auntie Joyce and just, like, start going around to neighborhoods. Because one thing I really want to do is wherever we move to, I want it to be, like, uh, like very active. So I'm thinking about playing around with the tool mod and like creating like little spaces around wherever they move to, to, so it could be interactive in between, you know, like be really good. All right, babies. We got a stinky baby, which means we have bath time for you. Give a bubble bath to Sakari. Wyatt is pretty much fine. He's just really tired. So let's have him go ahead and go to bed. And I need to make sure I stay on her because if I don't, she won't wash the baby. Okay. Let's make sure we stay on her girl because she will not wash this baby. Yes, let's get in the bath. Yes, scrub dub dub. Clean baby in the tub. All right, period. How cute. The Robbie girl, everything's gonna be just fine. We do not need, you do not need your parents. If anybody is causing you mental grief or stress, when you can go on here and remove them from your, um, from your, your aura, from yourself, from your presence. Cause child, ain't nobody got time for this. Ain't nobody got time for that. Oh, how cute. Okay, Sakari, time for bed. Uh-uh, time for bed, my love. Good night. You have you a good sleep. Now you, Miss Lady, you come over here and you take you some time as well. 
We're going to take us a thoughtful shower. We can get us some food finally. You know what? I feel like this deserves some some Uber Eats or something. We've been working our butts off. We deserve some Uber Eats. But then I order Uber Eats last part and it didn't work. Child, we're gonna see if it work. Um, let's go ahead and hire a service. Sokka, what is your purpose? I'm so confused. Why? Why are you here at midnight? For what? What's wrong? What is going on with him? Okay, now he's leaving. Sokka, I know you're going through stuff, but I am just genuinely confused, my man. What is going on? Should we call him back? Let's call him back. Once she gets out the shower. I'm just so confused by him. I want to order us some Uber Eats get us some good food girl what's something that you really want that you can't make yourself that you will splurge on come on you got you a little stimmy what you trying to eat um girl let's get some crab legs where they at they should be on here shouldn't they i think all my custom food is on here let me get some some crab cake uh a lobster roll some scout cookies oh we can get us some girl scout cookies okay shoot we got a uh, some dumplings we got girl get you some crown roast you deserve it so she actually was able to intersect this this is which is crazy did it say your food will be here in a second? No, like it's broke. Okay. What is the deal? Oh, now we're about to order food when we go back in the house. Okay. Let's go ahead and do that. And he's sad and I don't know what for. Now he's not sad. Okay, so can we check on him? Announce being pregnant. You're not pregnant. Uh, somebody was saying that in the last part, like I, I, I messed up or I misclicked. I didn't. She's not pregnant. She's not pregnant. Y'all, we ordering Uber Eats. Put this back. Look, the food is here. Not clean up, not clean up. Look, get the Uber Eats from uh, Raven. Hey girl, take the food. $99 for some roast? Well, look, we got our stimmy. We not, we not concerned, period. Why'd she get in the house? Okay. Girl, put, where you gonna put the roast? Hello? So, oh, she put it back here, child. Here, let's grab a serving. Or let's, no, girl, no, thank you. Let's grab a serving, let's sit on the couch and let's talk to Sokka, cause I'm really confused about him and everything that this child is going through. What's the issue? Why come over? Why well, come over about, oh wait, we do need to do that. Ask about protection. Y'all need to be using that if y'all do have y'all little moment. Yes. But like, what's the, what what's, what's going on? Can we check on him now? Uh, what can we do? memories talk about getting out yes let's talk about getting out i hope i was hoping we could do the little check on thing but i guess we can't now this boy just confuses the heck out of me 
Can we? Oh, can we ask him his career? Do you have a job? What's your job? Let me see. Ask about career. It was nice to get out the house today. I'm so glad I decided to get out. It was nice, the Robbie. It was real nice, girl. You're not gonna ask him about his job. Ask him about his job, sis. This TV is real loud for my babies to be sleeping. Here, put this back in inventory. Sake is under child. Good night. I thought he was working. I do think that is a glitch because didn't we give him a job in a live stream or something? Because Sarabi's job literally disappears every time I load up. I have no time. We're going to sleep. Sokka, you can do whatever. He causes me stress. He definitely calls me stress. Chow, go home. Oh, somebody wants to buy our painting. Okay, we'll take care of that in the morning. Let's just get us some rest, baby. And I want to go look at potential places. I want you guys to tell me in the comments down below where y'all think we, we should move to. Cause I really do want to get her a house done. And I think we're going to start building the house on a live stream. So make sure y'all tune into Twitch so we can start building her house. But I just, I think, I think my sis need a clean slate. Okay. Cause I, I've never been so confused about who to be with mine, like ever. <laughs> and he confuses the heck out of me. Not you drinking some milk. He said Dee Dee's bones. Okay. And then let's go ahead and move this to the dryer. And uh, we're going to go ahead and use the bathroom. How are my babies? They ready to get up? Oh, they are. Perfect. Time for potties and potties. And this morning, they're just going to have them some cereal. Yeah, we're just going to get a baby some cereal. I can come get y'all some food. And then y'all, your father will be here to get y'all because, child, I am... Oof, Lord. What's wrong? Here, come use this potty. It's two potties. There you go. What? Girl, don't be gasping like that. You scared me. So everybody's in fantastic moods, which is really good. Let's go ahead and get another one of these um, paintings done. Freelancer. Let's get another environmental concept done. Oh, and we also got to do, we also have to ship this off. Oh, ooh, $2,000, yeah. So Robbie girl, you better get that fame. I wish you should, you should be able to get fame when you sell on Plopsy, like that should be a thing. You can be like a famous Etsy-er. Okay, I have a baby who was angry. Look, Wyatt does not play about his food. He's like, it should be hot and ready on my hot chair when I wake up. Oh, my baby's gonna need some attention and stuff today. I wish it wasn't raining. Maybe it'll clear up and we could go for a little bike ride. I'm gonna get you some food. Okay, how we doing over here, girl? Okay, we got the second one done, which is good. I wish it would show me what she's making, because I really don't know. All right, we got that done. We might as well just go ahead and do this other one. Let's come over here and sit and do this last one. So our internship is over on Saturday. So if we take a look at it, Saturday is our last day of our internship. And then we have this entire week off because it will be like Christmas and New Year's and all that kind of stuff. We do have our flea market on Sunday. I really do think that we're about to be wrap up with this house because I really do want her to have a house and we're going to design it on we're going to design it on um, on Twitch. But we do have to pick a neighborhood. That's what we're going to go do. Hey, do you want to go on a date? Absolutely. What? Child. No, I don't want to go on a date. 
I just think they should co-parent. I think I'm officially deciding that they're going to be co-parents. Maybe they'll they'll slip up and you know they have their moments or whatever. But right now, I can't deal with Sokka. I I just can't. He, I want them to be together, but he's just so confusing, child. Yes, y'all better talk to each other. Let me look at our baby skills. Look at this, proud aunties and uncles. Look at this. Our babies are geniuses. They are really getting up there. Why don't they ever go to daycare? I just realized. Do I not, Amari? Oh, I forgot. I'm supposed to be doing it another way. Um, but we're gonna call a babysitter though, because we definitely need a babysitter. And we're gonna call. We shouldn't have to do this, but we're gonna just call Sokka as the babysitter. And her and Auntie Joyce are gonna go scout out the places. Oh, it's not raining. We could have went on our bike ride. We could have. Of course, I can babysit. I'll be there in a few minutes. Okay, perfect. Okay, here, your father's coming. He's on his way. Okay. So I definitely want to get out the desert because I want snow. So let's see. Let's see. Um, yeah, I don't want to be here anymore. We have Willow Creek. I can't remember the last time I lived in Willow Creek. It's been a little bit of a minute. This area looks really good. Maybe we should come down here and look. Uh, do we know any of these people? No, let's just go here with Auntie Joyce. And we're going to scout. Auntie Joyce, your eyes still ain't healed yet. I'm trying to tell you, she need a frozen hand bone on that thing. She really do. She need a little hand bone. Okay, look, it's snowing. Oh wait, no, I think her eye did heal. Oh, it did. Yay. Ask about today's plan. Like, okay, so what are we, what are we planning? Oh, she's a little bit uncomfortable. What's wrong? We ask her what's wrong. Talk about something that happened in the past. Aww. Oh, wait, it really means a lot to me that you make time for me. Just wanted to let you know they are so, I love Auntie Joyce and I love, I love them so much. They're so cute. Okay, this neighborhood, this is Willow Creek. This is the little cul-de-sac neighborhood. Um, Remember we're in the safe house, so that's why all the houses look the same. So we have like some townhouses, it looks like here and i think these are more townhouses i don't think this is my cup of tea they look different from the yeah so this is like a whole like little townhouse community uh, i don't know they are so freaking adorable growing closer from quality time i love them so much um i don't know if this area in willow creek is what we're looking for i feel like it's a little too matchy and like Sarabi's house, I don't think it would fit in here. I mean, I don't think her house will fit in anywhere if I'm being completely honest, but I really don't think it'll fit in here. Let's find another neighborhood. Let's see where else we can go. Um, I mean, we could go to another area. This place doesn't look so matchy matchy. Okay, this place doesn't look that bad. Let's go to this section of Willow Creek. So we have the Foundry Cove, which is like the the neighborhoods. And then over here is the Courtyard Lane. Okay, so let's go over here to Courtyard Lane and see if we like this area a little bit different. So we have uh, a library, cafe, and vet clinic here. Also a nice park. In case we do want to live here in this area. So let's go here with Auntie Joy. And we're going to scope the area. Period. Let's scope. I don't know what other neighborhood she would live in. I mean, we got Brindleton. We have Newcrest. But, like, I want to live somewhere different. I, 
we do the whole windenberg thing okay this isn't bad i mean it's hard to really tell with the snow but you know this can be this can be something okay any amenities over here i do want to have a place where we can make a park so oh this bonus space back here is a plus this is nice. This could be like a really cute park area. We could put a couple of like swing sets out here. I like this. I like that part. We could put some swing sets and uh, maybe even some uh, little stalls and stands. And it looks like this neighborhood does have some kids. We see a lot of playground equipment in all of the areas, which is really nice. Okay. And it's not so matchy matchy. There's a swing set pretty much in every yard. So people have kids or grandkids or something, which makes me feel a little bit better. Auntie Joyce, I'm so dead. She over there dancing. So the courtyard lane looks, looks pretty decent. I don't really think she would have money to live in these other neighborhoods. The Pen Pendula and the Sage Estates. Yeah, we can't live in the estates, so. We're going to leave that over there, but the courtyard lane in Willow Creek looks pretty promising. We also have new crest, of course. Um, I've always lived on this lane. I don't think I've ever lived over here. So what is this area? Llama Lagoon. Oh, with lakeside walkways and public playground equipment. This neighborhood is just right. Oh, just it's just the right amount of cosmo. Come on now. This could be nice. Okay, so they have some playground equipment here. There also is a pool. Like, so this neighborhood comes with like a little pool access. The question is, who we kicking out? Let's look here. Okay, so Newcrest has the public playground area, which is what I wanted. We could, if they already have stuff, we could spruce it up a little bit. We can definitely do that. We need to spruce it up and we need to send sis out on some dates or something. Cause I don't think there's anything wrong with her wanting a little extra companion. Oh, and we do get snow here, which is a plus cause we really do want snow for the babies. So that's a plus. Where is this playground equipment they're talking about? Yeah, where that dope? Oh, is it right here? Oh, this, this is cute. That's it. Just a little bit of equipment. This lot is really big. I don't think we would want to do a lot that big. This one seems a little better. And then this one is our, our smaller lot. So they do have that little park over here, which isn't bad at all. This one is kind of closer to that to that lot so there is a little bit of a blizzard going on <laughs> so again it's hard to see but i think this is a 30 by 20 which isn't bad we will be kicking these people out though. new crest can be the move we can have like we can definitely use this spot over here to like you know we can get rid of all of this furniture and really like make a cute park and it could be right across the street. This is probably really promising. So we got Courtyard Lane and then we have Newcrest. Cause I think this would be the only spot she would live in Newcrest, either here or this lot. Either way, I like, I like this space. So maybe Newcrest is the move. Oh, look at them, their little family we're gonna kick out. This is horrible. Oh look, she came outside to dirty it up, period. Oh, look what you ordered, girl. Oh, she got her a coffee, period. Get you a coffee, sis. I know that's right. Oh, and then it also looked like they have like a cute little trail for bikes, which would be perfect. Look, she said I could come over here and get me some Starbucks too. Okay, y'all, Newcrest is looking really good. Newcrest is looking amazing. I don't even think I want to look anymore. We always live in Brindleton, so I don't want to really want to live in Brindleton. 
but i say we start building yeah i think we just going to decide on new crest i think we should go ahead and start on this a lot and start you know start building the house that she wants now i don't know if it's gonna have everything but having a park area is really important having a bike trail area where they can do their bikes is really important and being close to it of course is important but y'all this is where i'm gonna go ahead and in today's episode i hope you guys enjoyed it let me know what you think in the comments down below about everything we discussed um remember to uh, follow up on twitch with the building of the house and all that good stuff um I, I can't wait to hear what y'all have to say in the comments down below um in the next part we're just gonna continue with this house but i think i'm gonna put this on some dates but i think we may go for some older people maybe even some college people you never know maybe it's time to just move on from this little pool and just go out there and go out on a couple of dates y'all let me know what you think in the comments down below i will see you guys in the next one remember to stay beautiful stay lovely and have a grant grant today bye guys